in this video we're going to talk about the card collector Riku trophy. So for Riku is basically all the cards are like map cards and stuff like that. Uh, he has a preset deck so it's not like Sora's where you have to get a load of different variety of cards. Um, the only one that you might miss is the random Joker card and that is down to pure chance really. I got one pretty much immediately when I started the game. Um, I, I did both of them on Proud first uh, attempt because if you do them both on Proud you save a load of time replaying the game and doing all this and that so I'd recommend playing on Proud for the entirety of the game like as soon as you start. It's not that difficult, it is pretty tricky in parts but if you learn the game, if you learn how to get around certain things, learn certain combinations of uh, cards uh, in the slates and stuff like that, just like, um, yeah, it, there's loads of things you can do to circumvent the difficulty basically, but for Riku's it's pretty straightforward, you just play through his story, you get a card pretty much after every world, and then the random joke card should appear somewhere. Hopefully, and yeah, that's pretty much it for this one. If you do have any questions, please do let me know in the comments. And uh, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please do like and subscribe and comment. We've also got memberships and super chats on a lot. We've also got the Discord linked in the community tab on my page. So yeah, please do check that out. Thanks for watching. Take care. Peace out.